Welcome back everyone, this is Ultra Lavos, playing Final Fantasy VI. Let's go with Terra, Edgar, and Bannon and see how their raft ride is going. I guess it's not going to be easy. Now uh, we can encounter Monster Group 2, then Monster Group 1, then Monster Group 1. All a 50% chance. I'll be back. And seeing as how you don't have Sabin anymore, uh, it's still basically the same. Uh, you just don't have access to his auras, so the battles will be taking a little longer. But uh, everyone else, just the same thing. Make sure to confuse those guys, cast fire, and heal with Bannon. You'll be fine. So we're heading down the river. Down the river. I think this t was this the first time you got to ride around on a raft on a river instead of a canoe? And control it on Final Fantasy game, I think so. Anyways, we end up here, which looks familiar. Which, there's Narsh right there, so. Yeah, all these fights will look familiar. I'm not gonna show any of them, it's the exact same ones you would have faced earlier. But there is something that's kind of funny that I do want to show you. Let's uh, head down here. Alright, where am I heading? Way down here? Maybe. Trying to remember. There's the cave. Let's go to the left. We're not going there yet. Just, uh, yeah, there it is. Now, I'll be right back. I'm gonna save my game just in case anything messes up. Alright, let's go in here and go, uh, riding on a chocobo. Well, first, let's put Bannon in the front. say hello. Yes, yes. Alright. Awesome, we're gonna go riding on a... What the hell is going on there? Did you see that? Did you see the craziness that happened? Yeah, he does not have a sprite, so since he's not one of your uh, main characters that you get, I am lost. But he doesn't have a uh, chocobo riding sprite, so if you saw all that nonsense that was happening there when I was exiting the stable, and it looks kind of weird too with me riding on him right now, but that's why. I've heard from people that sometimes that can cause the game to crash, which is why I saved it, but get off of here and continue on now that we're done with that fun stuff and I don't want Bannon in the front I actually would prefer to have Edgar in the front for now all right well we're back in Narsh so let's uh maybe but I didn't know what I was doing That's not very nice. Damn. I'm sure we can take these guys. Well, kind of. Well, it looks like we're not going through there. Well, let's go ahead and heal up. No sense in having any HP missing. Well, it's a good thing Locke showed Terra this earlier. Hey, guys. Yeah, something right here. Yeah, I'm sure there is. That's pretty awesome. Oh, uh, now these caves are pretty much the same. We've been through them. Yeah, the enemies are the same as earlier, but they die a lot faster now because we have three people and they're leveled up a lot more. So, which way are we going? Okay, yeah, because that's just nothing there. Let's head up this way. Hmm, nowhere to go. Th what was that? Oh, there's an old man up there. I wonder what he's doing. Same old stuff in here. And what's... 
What's going on here? Well, I guess maybe we should follow that path. Yeah, we could, but I kind of want to fight a couple enemies. Yeah. Tag the glimmering light. Yeah, see how there's a... I think that's nine. If you tag the odd-colored one, you can get out of it, but I don't want to. I want to get into some fights. You got like a 75% chance to get in a battle with these two dark sides, which we should kill pretty easily. This isn't the one that I'm wanting though. I'm gonna keep getting tagged by that light until I get the 25% uh, chance battle and I'll show you it. Here we go, finally. We've got Dark Side there, Spectre, and Ren. And uh, we want these for later, so. Oh yeah, they should, most of them be dead. Now they should all be dead. So there's that. Now I'm actually going to go back to the, the room that we just passed that I somehow made it through without getting into a fight. And There's a few uh, formations here I can get. And here's one. We've got a uh, wild rat in a first class. Another one of them repo man, uh, flea man looking enemies. And, uh, they don't, none of, those two do anything special, really. They're just basically attack you. But there's two more formations, so I'll see you when I get them. And look, this is one right here. Just basically three of the first class, so. You're gonna go down pretty quick. Nothing special. And the hardest formation in this room, and I'm using hard very loosely. Ah. Uh, only because it's got the most enemies, but yeah, you've got three of those rats and two of those ugly wrench guys. But they all died. Right. Hopefully I can get back to that room without getting in another battle. And we get to watch this again. Yep, I know the path. I'm going to mess up on purpose once, just to see if I can tag. There you go. That's what happens. So if you don't feel like following the correct orders... Well, I messed up, but you see what I'm saying. And it always starts you back here at the beginning, so... Let's go the right way this time, if I can remember it. I think I know. I just saw it. I should know. It's, I did. Ugh. I know. Really? I take it step too far, and yeah, it's not very forgiving. Ah! Mother. Let's see if I can do it. There we go. It's not that hard. It's just I kept moving a little too far. And what's in here? This is where... Um... Yeah, this is where Terra passed out right there, and the Moogles came to her rescue. And speaking of Moogles, Koopo! Is that what you're all going to say? Is that... Well, you said Koopo Po. You know, if you were a Pokemon, I would assume that you were not Moogles, but you were Koopos. Let's see, we could grab that treasure chest. Now, it's a rune blade, which is actually a pretty decent weapon right now for Terra. But if we leave it, it'll become something even cooler later. I believe it's a ribbon. See, that's where that weird looking place went. Can't get back in there though. Nope. So one way. 
And you should recognize this cave. Man, random battles just seem to love me today. The chests are still there. We don't want to get them because the contents are still the same. So let's just make our way back and uh, meet up at the old man's house. You know, the one that likes to shove things in our pockets. But before we go there, let's go ahead and unequip everyone. I'll do that and be right back. Now, you can't remove Bannon's equipment, but the reason I'm doing this is because the scenario is almost over. Let's go through here. Say, hey there, old... Not that old. Harvest, he's got a name. Well, uh, we got things to do. Well, that's kind of not good. Tara went kind of berserk, too. I guess she didn't really go berserk, but she passed out. Well, hopefully it's the saving, because the other thing doesn't seem as good. And we're done with that scenario. We'll choose one of the other two next time. I haven't decided which yet. Probably Savin. This is Ultralavos playing Final Fantasy VI. See you all next time.